Hello, this is Ironhead41. Uh, this is my third garden patch. It's pretty good size. It's about 40 foot across here, about 25 foot on that end, uh, about 50 foot. Uh, but I started this little patch three years ago and learned my lesson pretty good. It's got a lot of clay in it. So uh, when I plant, make these rows, uh, I put straw on it because the sun will bake. I mean, man, it'll bake this ground hot in just a couple of hours. And so the straw on the rows, it helps keep in the moisture because this sucker here, it'll dry out. It'll, it can rain an inch today and tomorrow it'll be just powdered dusty because it's got so much clay. It just don't hold any kind of moisture. But boy, that straw really does it to it. Uh, I was having a conversation with Goat Hollow here a while back and he had the nerve tell me, boy, you go buy some beet mammoth red mangles seeds. And I'm like, oh man, you don't tell me what to do. Huh, who do you think you are? I told him, didn't I? <laughs> well, then I went out and bought some. <laughs> From Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds, I have beet mangles planted in these two rows. <laughs> uh, this is actually, uh, was highly used for livestock feed back in the 1800s. Each one is supposed to get about 20 pounds. And uh, for... I think uh, 250 seeds, it was $2 and a half, and then about a dollar or something shipping. So that's pretty cool. But I planted uh, 60 right here. I'm going to try these out and see how they do as a, a livestock feed. I'm supposed to cut it up and feed it to the animals and uh, the chickens and goats and horses and all. And that's, that's automatic feed. Uh, if they take to it real well and they stay healthy over the, you know, on up into the fall, I'm going to plant another 60. Uh, to store for the winter because it says it'll store all winter long uh, in the ground you can just cover it up or, or put it in a root cellar or basement or something or just put it somewhere dark and cool I think this would be a good investment try some of these beet mangles and let's see what happens <laughs> I'm just playing with you goat goat boy <laughs> that's it